Sergei Sevastyanov, slash TASS. A Russian rocket fell to a watery resting place on Wednesday after an uncontrolled re-entry into Earth's atmosphere. The Persei booster was launched on December 27 by the heavy lift Angara A5 rocket for a test mission. However, the upper stage booster failed to enter the Earth's orbit as planned. Instead, it began inevitably being pulled back toward the atmosphere by Earth's gravity for an expected return to the surface in bits and pieces, if at all, on Wednesday afternoon, Pacific time. I do not regard this object as a significant risk, leading orbit watcher and astronomer Jonathan McDowell said on Twitter. Reentries for an object with dry mass of about 4 tons may see some debris reach the ground, but not much. The rocket is thought to have weighed around 20 tons, but over 75% of that mass would have been in fuel that almost certainly would have burned up in the atmosphere. The 18th Space Control Squadron of the U.S. Space Force confirmed that the rocket re-entered over the Pacific Ocean just after 1 p.m. Pacific Time on Wednesday. Hashtag 18 SPCS has confirmed the re-entry of the IPM3 slash Percy, number 50505, 2021-133A, at 1308 Pacific Daylight Time on January 5, 2022, over the Pacific Ocean. Hashtag Space Flight Safety, 18th Space Control Squadron, at 18 SPCS, January 5, 2022. The odds are the remains of most space junk that re-enters will end up in the ocean or somewhere uninhabited and never be found. Typically, large rockets or spacecraft that are expected to re-enter the atmosphere are steered into a remote part of the ocean. However, uncontrolled re-entries do happen from time to time, like the widely followed return of China's Tiangong-1 space station in 2018. They've rarely resulted in much damage or casualties, although there have been unconfirmed reports of Chinese rocket boosters falling onto rural communities.